Hi Capricorn, it's Elle here to do your general reading. We're going to keep this short and sweet. Okay, um, thank you to those who support the channel by clicking the like button, subscribing to the channel. Um, so Capricorn, let's get started. Make sure you are clicking that like button. It's much appreciated. Subscribing to the channel. bottom of the deck we have the nine of wands all right some of you I mean some of you might be at the brink of you know do I so the nine of wands so wands cards are about growth and about expansion it's about um, movement um, energy this says for some of you do I allow an ending or do I reduce it back maybe to the eight of wands where I'm then trying to have the strength to move it forward maybe in a better direction something has been troublesome taxing burdensome you may be at a place of um, separation from a particular situation person job home this is a person in contemplation about do I allow the ten of wands where I lay down what was or what is burdensome or do I um, reduce this and try to start over could be dealing with a fire sign Aries Sagittarius Leo what do I do in <clears throat> excuse me in terms of growth or or letting something die okay you could have been dealing with something for nine or more months years weeks days it's also could be related to health okay we have the ten of cups the Eight of Pentacles, the Six of Cups, the Hangman, the Four of Wands. So this could be a relationship, whether it's platonic or romantic. Um, this is a situation where you, a particular person place or thing or whatever it may be makes you very happy this is the highest level of happiness this is the, the culmination of whatever makes you happy the relationship ten of cups could be dealing with a water sign cancer pisces scorpio um, some of you could have family or you could be dealing with someone who has a family um what this says is that you need to either have strength to work on the situation, put work back into the situation, or you need to have strength in knowing that maybe all of this work you did in a particular, maybe family unit or in relationship to, or whatever it may be, um, you need to know that this is a situation where you may have to recognize that all the work, effort, time, energy spent in in a particular relationship job just didn't you, it was almost as if you can ask yourself the question um what was i doing it for or where did you know all this time and energy what was it for because it didn't 
yield you exactly what you wanted. This also may be a time where you need to muster up the inner strength to work on yourself, to examine yourself, work on your own self, your own craft, work on becoming the Nine of Pentacles, maybe independent, single, or sing singular in some sense. Because this may be a decision or a choice that you have to make about a past person, a soulmate, maybe your children, uh, a decision that you have to make in regards to love, love of, you, you fill in the blank, um, a choice of do I choose someone from my past, do I choose someone who's older than me or younger than me. You have it nostalgic thoughts of the past. So now that's why it comes to choice that you have to make in regards to some of you. It's a family dynamic that just didn't yield you what you wanted. Are you becoming single? Are you allowing something to end? Or are you going to put more work and effort and time back into it? You're at the hangman status, maybe in regards to a Piscean person. Trying to look at a situation from a different perspective, gain clarity, waiting for a, another piece of information, waiting for the other shoe to drop, uh, beating yourself up in regards to maybe feeling like you put energy, effort, and time into someone, love. You expended time, money, and love into somebody and it just didn't yield you maybe the relationship or the stable relationship you were looking for you feel as if a particular person is a soulmate is a twin flame or whatever I don't really subscribe to all of that but you feel like this person is wish fulfillment they um yeah you feel like they were sent from heaven this is what you pray for but even in that it, it just didn't work out maybe in your favor. And there was an ending. And there is separation. Or you feel like there's an ending. This is also a person. Contemplating. Um, going back to. Or having communication with another. Particular person. Or. People. Or job. This is a person in heavy contemplation about how they feel about the work, energy, effort, time put into a situation where now they're at a standstill in regards to what they're building, either with person or without. Okay, so that's where you are. This could be marriage. This could be job. This could be relationship that went awry it just stopped you know and there's opportunity to come back together but you have to evaluate do you even want to do that um you have to see either waiting or you have to see something from a different perspective maybe not just your own you also could be devising plan of action to take in regards to Cultivating a relationship or stability in you fill in the blank. You know. Alright. Let's see. What are the angel answers you have to speak for in the near future. Okay. Yes, we have a yes answer. Alright, that's nice. Remain positive. Uh, you're ready at the bottom of the deck all right so what we're going to do is clarify these cards over at the website um it looks pretty good this is not a bad reading it's just like capricorn wondering which which way to go there's only two options here um having a whole bunch of feelings energy effort time spent but i don't what i don't see are any decision making cards so maybe just really trying to figure it out 
energetically and emotionally okay all right so meet me over at the other side always remember that to get an extended read especially if this is resonating with you thus far is uh one dollar 75 cent click click the link below one dollar 75 cent gets gets you the extended reading um happy holidays a uh, happy new year uh this is the mid december 2018 reading uh for capricorn i don't know if i said that or i said something wrong okay anyhow take care guys remember to stay in prayer i'm praying for you pray for me as well bye